Hello guys and welcome back. It's Project Universal here and we are back on the site to see what exactly is going on. So we can see they've got one of those machines set up. Now that's the machine that does the core drilling I believe. So this is probably, now what were they called again? I can't remember what they're called. I'll put it up on the screen now. It's probably those guys doing further investigations. Uh, most of the vans have gone. There's two cars parked uh, by the main entrance. Probably security as they've got stuff on site. They did have a mini digger, yeah. The mini digger's still there. So I would hazard a guess that security will be hanging around tonight, which is good. Um, the guy with the car. Now... If you're wondering what I'm talking about, you'll need to go and watch this video that I'm going to put in the top corner now. This is the video where we first, uh, uh, this morning, not this morning, the, the, in the morning where we first noticed it. Actually, it was this morning. I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, but this is the next day for you guys in the video. Um, I just wanted to sort of try and get a catch up of what they're doing. And they've got their kit set up to do the core drilling. Actually, that might be the car. Um that we did see the other day. Let's just check the rest of the area to make sure there's no one around and we can get a better angle then. No, there's nobody here, which is nice. Um, yeah, it's all good. Let's go and see if we can get a slightly lower angle so we can see what is going on over there. First off, we can be sneaky and go and have a little look over here, can't we, before we attempt to go near humans. We can just see what they've got here. They've got a uh, trailer with barriers on it. Um, welfare unit and a digger. Baby digger. So these guys, yeah, look, you can see now that they've got like an A-frame up. I don't know the technical terms, but that's definitely some kind of A-frame. That they've got up there. Um, he's having a look at me. So he knows I'm here. But we won't get very close. There's three people there. Yellow man, orange man and a black. A man in black shall we say. <laughs> ah, no, never mind. Water bowels. So that was clearly to pump water down where they. Hmm, that's odd. Oh maybe they did that one today. I was going to say. Look here where this arrow is pointing. There is a. A well there which is very strange there is a well there uh, a borehole sorry so that they've obviously highlighted the need for for something in the area could be water drainage water table water something I think it's something to do with water I think they're testing um, I think what the guy was doing earlier on when he when he looked to be poking stuff, sorry, in the last video, sorry, I should keep saying that. If I say earlier on, I mean in the last video, which was yesterday's, um, and we've already linked to it. I'll put a link in the description. I'll call it part one or something. Um, yeah, he was, is he taking a photo of me? Hello, smile. These are the conditions we've got to work in. There was a drone pilot who was 60 or 70 metres away from me. No, I'm joking. He's probably not saying that at all. He'll better things. They, they, they know the deal. They've got more important things to worry about than some pillock with a drone flying around them. You know, as I said before, if you if you get a drone flying, if you're on this site and there's a drone flying at a respectable distance and holding that respectable distance from any human beings, um, that's me. It's going to be me. But if you've got someone twatting around, then no, it's not me. So there you go. It's another one of those frames. Let's get away from the railway line. Um, and uh, that's all it is. Short little sweet video. We'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Follow me on social, subscribe and all that nonsense. But for now, ta-da.